Okay, everyone, Miss Atkins, second grade class. <laughs> uh, we're going to go over our lesson for today, Science Matters, the three state of matter. What are the three states of matter? Solid, Solid liquid, liquid, and gas. gas. Good, okay, gas. so everybody, gas. we're just going to go over this really quickly. So everybody say hi. Say hi. hi. My second graders. Hi, mommy. <laughs> oh, thank you, Miss Atkins. It's Miss Atkins. Mason, mommy. mommy. Okay. okay. All right. Today's lesson, we're going to learn the three states of matter. We're going to listen to the song that you heard yesterday in class, but this time we're going to sing and dance along. You excited for that? All right. Now, we'll make sure that we use the dance moves that we discussed in class. Listen to the rhythm and stay on beat the best you can, okay? When you hear the song say, now watch me dance, you get to create your own dance all on your own. Are you excited? Yeah. Okay. But you just have to, all the, the only rule is you have to, well, first have fun. Is that cheesy? And then you have to choose if you're going to do a solid, a liquid, or a gas. I'll be gas. Raise your hand. Yes, Landon? I need gas. You want to be gas? I'll Addison, be liquid. liquid. I will be solid. You want to be solid. Awesome. So when you have to do your own moves, you have to think really quick and think of a move that looks like you're you're chosen. Okay, that's all you gotta do. So Landon, if you choose gas, what kind of move would a gas do? Show your gas. Do you want to show me? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Good. <laughs> so we get to conduct our very own experiment after that. So let's get through it as quick as we can. Show me how good you did. And we're going to get to witness a change in the state of matter. Oh and then we get to eat it. <gasps> Can you guys guess what we're doing if we're going to eat it? Hmm. Play it. You want to play? Okay. Are you ready to do your dance? Mm -hmm. All right. Let me load it. Class pet. <laughs> Stand up. You can just watch it on my screen since it's not wanting to take this band stabber. I'll show him getting ready for the video. Now remember, we did our dance that we did in class, okay? Get a little closer so I can get you in the video. There you go. Do your best. Do the beat. Stay on the beat, Landon. Sing the words that you know, okay? Do your beat for me. There you go. Stomp, clap. <laughs> there you go. Do the beat, Landon. Stay on beat. Do your dance. Landon's gas. Kirsten solid. Good. You're liquid. Good. I think gases can get a little crazier. Oh my goodness. All right, solid go. <laughs> Good. Liquid. <laughs> Good. Go gas. All right. Is everybody feeling warmed up for class now? Are we? All right, so we're gonna go to the lab now, okay? Okay. Everyone go. All right, has anyone figured out what we're doing yet? No. He can sit on the corner, so that's fine. Sit down here. Okay, so your ingredients are back here. 
All right, Miss Atkins already put four cups of ice in this big bag. All right, so I want you to open the big bag. I wanted to be able to let all of you do your own experiment. However, budget cuts got us down to one, so. <laughs> all right, so there's four cups of ice. So now I want you to, in the small bag, so get the small bag, and then my um, older second graders will help here, and then we'll take turns shaking it up, okay? So Landon, I want you to watch the girls. Now in the little bag, we need one tablespoon of sugar. I so find it. I love you too. Get a tablespoon of sugar, make sure it's an even tablespoon. If it's a little over, that's okay, just make it sweeter. Because remember, we get to eat this. Here. Get a little more. That's salt, don't eat that, that would taste yucky. And I already have your salt measured out here too, because we only had a little bit of salt. <laughs> All right, so you have your tablespoon of sugar, what's next? One half a cup of half and half. All right. So what's half a cup? If you had to, if you had to do it now, just put, go ahead and put that last bit of ice in there. Um, so if a cup is eight ounces, what's half a cup? What's half of eight? Um, four. four. So you need to get four ounces of the half and half okay. into that cup. Okay. Mama. What? Let me get down this and eat the ice cream plate. Okay. All right, do we have the four ounces? Yes. Okay, empty that into the bag. Just be really careful. What's next? Uh, fourth teaspoon of vanilla. Okay, so is that your fourth? Yes. Be careful. There's napkins if you need it because that's an easy thing to overflow. Yes, Go ahead and open your bag and you're just going to put the one fourth in. That. It's for flavor, baby. That's okay. That's okay. Maybe just a little bit more milk. Okay. To offset it, you know what I mean? We can do to the little Just do one. like one more ounce. That That's fine. That's fun. That's enough. There we go. Sorry, experiment doesn't fail. Okay, so now you're going to zip that up. Make sure it's secure. Okay. Good and secure. Now, you're going to take your big bag. You're going to dump in that half a cup of salt. No, not yet. Put the half cup of salt in there. All right, mix it up just a little. Now, put your little bag on top of the ice. Make sure everything's very secure because if it leaks in that salt, we won't have very good taste in an experiment, okay? All right, so because it gets really cold, it's going to get extra cold. The ice is actually going to get colder. What is this? What is happening here? That's okay. That's just water from the ice. All right, so put this underneath it since we don't have gloves. Because I'm telling you, it's going to get very, very cold. Just kind of use that as something to keep you from. Okay, Landon, you shake first. All right, so hold it right here. That way nothing spills. I want you to start rocking it back and forth. Addison, back and forth. I want you to, I need you to start it, okay? okay. Good job, at Landon. Good job. All right, now take turns. You're going to take the whole thing. I want you to hold it. There you go. Now I want you to make sure everything's moving back and forth. Kirsten's start. turn. Not upside down. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Leave it sitting upright. Yeah, Here. Mama. Only point this on the kids. Ow. Okay, so we're going to keep shaking. But more of a rocking motion. Here. Here you go. Poor kid. Okay, uh, she's my daughter, I can say that. Now listen, nor what we should have done before, but Miss Atkins forgot, so it's her fault, is we have a thermometer. We measure the ice before we put the salt in, okay? And then we measure the ice again after it's been on the salt and rocked back and forth for a while. And we record the difference, okay? So that won't be on your assessment. So you got lucky right there, okay? But literally all we're doing is we're taking turns rocking this back and forth, okay? And you should start seeing it thicken up. Start. Yeah. You got to start telling. I need you to report the changes that you're Here, seeing. Okay. Rock it back and forth. Rock it towards me. Help each other. There you go. Okay. There you go. Good job. Good, Landon. Crazy. What now? Tell me what changes are you seeing? The liquid, it's liquid, liquid vanilla is getting it's turning thicker. into a solid. Is it getting? Oh, so what was it 
before when we put it in there, what kind of substance was it? Liquid. Liquid. So the liquid is what's happening to the liquid to make it more of a solid and um, cold, right? The, so, the solid ice cubes are changing. <laughs> so the ice cubes, but what's happening to the ice cubes, it's making that turn into a solid. They're uh, turning into a gas. No, good good try. The salt is actually making the ice even colder. It's making its freezing point colder. It's dropping the temperature and it's freezing your salt your liquid and turning so it solid. Cool. And when we're done, all of our ingredients is going to make ice cream. <gasps> oh, yeah. <no. laughs> so it, sometimes it takes 15 minutes, but if you just keep going, it won't take that long. Now, I have worksheets that are going to go home with you. Go back and forth. And I'm going to go ahead and give you a little review while you're shaking. Let's shake quietly, okay? Now, the old, uh, my older kids, I want you to feel the bag and tell me if it feels colder now that the ice has uh, had time to react with the salt. All right. How, how much do you, how, if you had to write how much colder it was from one to five, how much colder is that? 20 to 30 degrees difference. <laughs> it's a big difference, right? Yeah. Addison, now you feel how much colder the ice is. That's very it's, cold. It's so cold it, it would hurt your hand if you didn't have gloves. So yeah. if anyone repeats this, don't be like us and forget gloves. And if you have to, you can move the salt around to where it kind of covers it more. Does that make sense? Good. As long as you don't poke a hole. Yeah, you can shake some more. Got the bottom. Now shake it towards the back this, <laughs> there you go. this lesson is geared towards second grade. It can be done at any grade level. I have a 15-year-old sophomore. I have an 11-year-old sixth grader and a four-year-old preschooler. And they're all in, equally enjoying this. So this experiment can definitely be done at any age. And it takes time, but we just rock it back and forth until it gets to a thickness that we want. That one's more of a preference at that point, but... Okay, so the salt, solid, liquid, or gas? The salt, solid. It's now. But no, in the beginning, this is going to be on your test tomorrow. Okay, so what is the salt in the in the? Solid. It's a solid. A solid. Good. What is the half and half creamer? Liquid. Okay. What about the sugar? Solid. Now the 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 um. Can we hand that to Addison and go see what the class pets are getting into into the living room. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, Landon. okay, so the salt and the sugar are solids. Are, are What kind of solid? Are they soluble or non-soluble? Soluble means. Good question. Soluble means that it can dissolve into something. The salt is, is soluble. Soluble. Good job. That's crazy. Is it getting thicker? Yeah, I mean, it's not thick, but it's gotten thicker than it was whenever we first started. I Can I help you? Needs to go use the bathroom. Raise your hand and ask. You just, you just want mom. Okay. <laughs> Come here, buddy. All right. Oh, something's almost fell. You just keep shaking. Okay, so what, what you missed, Kirsten? <laughs> was that salt and sugar is a soluble solid. That means it can be dissolved, okay? So it becomes part of their half and half, therefore it becomes part of the liquid. And then the liquid, does it heat up or does it get really cold to turn into a solid in this experiment? It's really cold. All right, really cold. <laughs> they copied. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mama. All right, now. He's okay. He's okay. If you have to move your move your ice cubes around to where it's covering all of it, you can even you can even like open the bag and move it if you need to. Just make sure. You know, obviously we've already washed our hands. I know we didn't mention that in the video, but you can kind of shake the ice around to where it kind of. Just be careful touching it. Yeah, <laughs> be careful touching it. Um, we're not supposed to run out of class, Landon. <laughs> All right. 
Come back to your spot, Addison. Let him go. He's little. Ice is very cold. Now, now what you can do is you'll just pinch the top too, the way they don't leak. There, you can shake it a little harder this time. It's not going to hurt to shake it hard. There you go. It's probably going to work quicker this way. It's neat, it's huh? It's like in an oobleck form. A what? A what? Miss oobleck. An oobleck form. You know what that is? It's where you make corn starch and stuff. It's mm -hmm. another science project. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can feel the coldness now through the towel. Mm -hmm. Keep shaking it. Let's try to get our ice cream for the video in. We'll have a couple of minutes. Yes. We getting thicker? Mm -hmm. Good. We use this hand sanitizer too. Yes. After we our hands were hand. clean. That's so cool. It's like a it's solid. Mm-hmm. That's awesome. It's getting thicker now that we're shaking yeah. it. See, and you shook it harder, so the salt actually is working more on the ice now. So it's it's getting it good and cold to make your ice cream. Is it thick enough to eat, or is it still pretty liquidy? It's not thick enough yet. It's almost there, Feel isn't that. it? That's <laughs> crazy. It's at, at almost eight minutes. <laughs> All right, and I think it's thick enough for us just to show for the experiment for the camera. Do you think so? And then you guys get to try it. No, no, no. Still liquid. It's kind of like a paste, paste. whipped cream form. <laughs> Would you like to come try the ice cream? Yeah, I'm going to open it. That's fine. Just make sure you don't let it mix with that salt. Okay. So now, first, we're going to... There you go. Put it on the napkin. Now, remember, if we had more time, then we would probably sit and shake it till it got nice and hardened, because it will. So, I want you to show the consistency. Go past the foam there. Let's, it's thick towards the bottom. Toward the bottom. So, get some toward the bottom there. That way, we can show, okay? Because I know the bottom... What, like, right there? Yeah. So, just kind of mix that foam down in there. That way we can show how it looks, okay? Oh, it's really thick. Only, like, only I only get it from the bottom so we can show. Right there. Here, you I can see it. that it's ice cream right yes. there. Yes. There you go. There's your mm -hmm. ice cream. All right. You guys ready to try Look. it and get your first reaction? Look at that. Uh-huh. You made ice what cream. What the heck? You ready to try You ready? Cheers. Cheers. Okay. Here we go. Homemade ice cream. We what? need to do this more often. That's crazy. <laughs> All right. Don't double dip, though. I know we're at home, but no double dipping. Coronavirus. Okay. So, I just really quick, just to wrap it up, I want you to tell me, uh, I want you to pick a couple of things that you noticed there in the experiment um, as far as the change of matter and maybe something you didn't know. Um, we'll start there. What's something you didn't know before this experiment? I didn't know that you could do half and half vanilla, salt, and sugar and mix it with ice in a bag and it turns into a solid. I it goes from no. all liquid liquids to solids. That's neat, huh? I had no idea that salt made ice um, cold. yeah. colder. Colder, right? And we all we did we use was table salt. You can use rock salt too, and I believe it makes it even colder and it works a little quicker, but oh my we didn't have that budget cuts. <laughs> Okay, now what is something that you, taking this, what's something, this is for critical thinking, higher learning. If you can't think of anything, that's okay. It, this experiment showed a change in the states of matter. What's something else that you'd like to try, whether it be changing the experiment or a new experiment, what would you like to try in the future? The oobleck one. <laughs> the oobleck <laughs> To make oobleck, it's a liquid and a solid. Yeah, mm. it is. It's like, like it's a weird taste. It, if you hit it. It turns to a solid, but if you just touch it, it goes liquid. Cool. It does. It's really cool. cool. Now, this works. experiment, what would you like to do next time to make it different? Change this. I like 
more of the half and half and vanilla. Something to make it more, well, take more time to make Chocolate it. syrup, yeah. make chocolate ice cream. We have chocolate syrup. We do. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, what we're going to do now is we're just going to end the video. We're going to do our cleanup so that we can line up and go to our next class. And I hope that you guys enjoyed. We can put them in here. Okay.